Hello again, it's Joey John McGrath in a very quiet Broadway bar and grill. My uh, local watering hole in Fulham Broadway, just up the road from Fulham Broadway Underground Station. Wonderful bar. Uh, I've been coming here for many years. It's uh, on four floors, uh, roof garden, everything, everything that you need here. Uh, wonderful food, wonderful staff, and most of all, terrific uh, ales. I'm about to uh, recite my latest poem. Done. It's one of two I did in the early hours of this morning, around about four o'clock. Uh, the first one uh, is called Unchecked and Unsurpassed. Forget the Arab Spring. Long gone, it was a distant dream. Stemming from a deserving people suppressed by poverty and regimes who now cower under threat of daily violence, atrocities and other happenings. There in ruined dwellings they sit and hide trapped in a cauldron of hatred of volcanic proportions, their continent now scarred in the aftermath of a heart-led innocent uprising. Empty speeches, forgotten promises, demonstrating the hypocrisy, all having fallen by the wayside, leaving the displaced masses clinging to their God, mourning their dead, with only one question coming from their eyes, why are they forsaken? As for the West, their hands tied, having been rendered impotent by the limp will of other nations, scratch their heads in bewilderment as they take heed of a savagery beyond human comprehension. Past tears, the Middle East is dying. The evil caliphate at the hub shows signs of retreat as its dying embers cease to glow above the desert sands. But a warning to you all who inhabit the earth, peace will be a long time in the making, that's for sure. There are others more evil than a human mind dare to even process, waiting in the wings for their chance to wreak havoc, their hatred intense, unchecked, and unsurpassed and their weapons are those of mass destruction. Joey John McGuire.